I'll tell you, tell you another quick story. I taught as a member of the faculty, engineering faculty at Villanova for 24 years. And I had some very interesting uh, relationships with some of the priests there, particularly with the Father President, but uh, they had a geography department. Um, it was composed of one man, and he taught all the geography courses there at the time. And he came to me one day and said, how about you coming up and teaching a course on Judaism? And I thought about it, and I'm an engineer. Of course, I had all this experience in the Hebrew school, but I thought, you know, that's a, that'd be a good opportunity. So I wrote out a, a, an outline for a lecture, and we scheduled the course, and I went up and taught this one period lecture a course for about five, six years in a row. And I would go up into the class and I would go up to the blackboard and I would write on the blackboard at the beginning of the lecture, David Yaakov ben Shloima Halevi. And I said, this is who I am, but not just who I am, but who I belong to and where I come from. And then I would explain to them, David Yaakov, that's my name. Actually, it's David J. Ben Schleima, that tells me a little bit more of who I am, son of Solomon. But it also tells me who my father was, Solomon. Halevi, ah, that tells me my whole history. I know my father. I know who my grandfather was because he was a Levi and he was a Levite because that tells me that it's passed down from one to the other. It also t tells me that I have a relationship there because I was named for him. So his name was David, David. But it also tells me that back in the distant past, I have an uncle Moses. Problem is, I can't fill in the gap from my grandfather to Moses, but it's there and it's a whole history. And I am a Jew and that's who I am and where I came from. And then I would go on to the lecture.